Good morning, good afternoon, everybody. Welcome to the session. My name is uh, Prabir Sekri, and I'm a Senior Solutions Architect with AWS, and I'm based out of Montreal, Canada. And I'm very excited to be joined by Etienne Bouillard. Uh, Etienne, do you want to introduce yourself, please? Hi, everyone. I I'm honored to be here. So I'm Etienne Bouillard. I've been at Indac since uh, 2020, uh, and I'm, I'm a specialist AI architect uh, in the data lab. Thanks, Etienne. So yeah, today we are very excited to talk to you about Intact Financial Corporation's journey in improving their critical contact center APIs, uh, KPIs with AI-powered call auditing and analytics solutions that they've built on Amazon Transcribe and other AWS serverless services. Yeah, so before we dive into Intact's use case, I thought it'd be a great idea to firstly talk about the need for artificial intelligence and machine learning, especially in the contact center space. Right, so there are a number of common context center challenges, such as uh, you know, might have seen the issues of growing context center traffic, the generally high agent turnover, and overall rising customer service expectations. And by using AI and ML, you can not only solve these challenges, but you can also lower costs to transform a context center from a cost center into a profit center. So some of the benefits that I want to highlight are really that you know you can increase customer satisfaction by offering a faster, more effective service. And this has a direct impact on your net promoter score or NPS or your CSAT score. Uh, and you can achieve this by ideally you know, reducing call wait times by servicing customers more efficiently, effectively, and accurately via digital contacts channels. You also decrease time to resolution by RTTR you know, with agent assistance. And this is based on the, the, the content of the calls and chat sessions to reduce the response time, right? So if you get to know about the context of the call and everything, it really helps reduce response time. Um, and this overall improves agent satisfaction because you can reduce call volumes by offloading repetitive issues or tasks to a chatbot. Or you can immediately alert supervisors for challenging interactions that may need interventions and helping them quickly so that they can be resolved as soon as possible. This overall helps in reducing operational costs because you are able to provide self-service technologies for redundant responses and really making the best use of your agent's time. And all of this helps you lower your turnover and reducing the minute calls that are sitting on your network waiting to be answered. And when we talk about business improvement opportunities, you can also capture more and better data to inform metrics on customer satisfaction, on potential product issues, compliance, script endurance, or even training gaps. And so therefore you can really mine these customer conversations and really gain insights on not only the product or service improvement opportunities, but also identify potential cross-sell or upsell opportunities. Now, in the last session, you heard that AWS offers two options to contact centers customers. So the first one being Amazon Connect and the other is CCI. Now, CCI solutions allow customers to add powerful ML power capabilities into third-party contact centers, which, are, which can be either on-prem or in the cloud, such as Genesis, Cisco, Talkdesk, Avaya, to name a few. And in this session, we will primarily be focusing on CCI or contact center intelligence and how it uses AWS AI services to solve common context center challenges. Now the AWS CCI solutions can be applied to three main use cases and customers can choose to start implementation with any of these use cases and move to other use cases based on their needs and success. And Etienne will be actually talking about this uh, today. Right, so the first use case that we have is really about self-service virtual agents, which includes conversational IBRs, chatbots, that can deflect calls by enabling users to quickly find answers or complete transactions on their own without the assistance of a live agent. These solutions can also identify the intent of a caller, as I mentioned earlier, and they can direct them to a proper agent and reduce the number of call transfers. Now in the real-time call analytics and agent assist space, so this is really about understanding the customers in real time. CCI solutions can process live conversations and understand the context of the call. And with agent assist, it can also help in reducing agent fatigue from uh, you know, the general information overload and really provide them with real time suggestions for answers that can be pulled from a knowledge base that you maintain or other data sources. 
With real-time analytics, customers' sentiment can also be monitored and supervisors can be alerted to jump in and help their agents uh, you know, if the calls are not going well. And really the goal of the solution is to really help reduce agent call handling time and reduce agent churn with effective real-time information. And lastly, the third use case is post-call analytics. So the post-call analytics or PCA, it, it's a solution that enables you to process 100% of your customer conversations, which allows you to give you a comprehensive coverage of all your customer conversations. Post-call analytics enables you to gain insights such as you know, emerging trends, <coughs> customer sentiment, and call drivers. It can also help to identify customer service and business improvement opportunities. So imagine with all these insights, you can really understand your customers and drive solutions to help solve their problems faster. The, the analytics can also help agent performance and monitor script compliance, I think, as I mentioned before. So today's session, we will be primarily focused on the post-call analytics piece. Now, you've already seen the slide before, right? But I just want to highlight this again. So, you know, underneath all of these solutions are the AWS AI Managed Services, or building blocks, as we call them. And they're taken from the top of the AI ML stack at, you know, from AWS. Uh, and you can implement these services without needing to be a data scientist or a deep machine learning expert. expert, expert. So what I wanted to do is that I just want to give you an example of how you can use these services together in your own CCI solution. So for example, you can start with something as a self-service solution such as Lex, which is our conversational AI service. Now this service can be combined with Amazon Polly's uh, text-to-speech service, which allow you to create powerful virtual agents and really automate frequently asked questions and transactions. Then there's also a transcribe, which is an automatic speech recognition service. So this service accurately converts all the live and recorded conversations into text for Amazon's Comprehend Natural Language Processing, which is another service. And this service allows you to detect sentiment, identify keywords, um, it can help you identify phrases, and even help you classify calls. You can feed all of this data, and you can also leverage Amazon Translate, which can be used to facilitate conversations between agents and customers in their preferred language. And lastly, we have Amazon Kendra, which can provide contextual search for boosting bots and uh, agent assist solutions with really getting the best answers from internal knowledge bases. So you can really consider all of these services as the foundational technologies that are being applied to existing contact centers around the world by offering you automation and insights for your customers. I want to take a moment and dive deep a little bit on Amazon Transcribe, which is, as I mentioned, our automatic speech-to-text AI service. It uses deep learning for speech recognition and is designed to handle a wide range of speech acoustic characteristics, including variations in volume, pitch, and speaking rate. Firstly, this is a fully managed service and is continuously trained that allows really for you to focus on your business. What it means is that we are doing the heavy lifting and we are building and maintaining the state-of-the-art speech recognition models for you. It is highly accurate. It has the highest accuracy or industry-leading accuracy for a range, range of use cases such as context center conversation, digital media, medical transcriptions across most languages. Transcribe also replaces the costly process of manual transcription with a highly accurate, more efficient process that scales with your needs. In terms of cost, Transcribe only charges for the real value delivered to the customer. So what I mean by that is that you know it's only charged based on the seconds of audio that are transcribed per month. Um, let's take the context center use case for, as an example. You know, we understand that you know in a, con in a typical context center conversation, there's always a caller and an agent, um, and they're always conversing at the same time. So it's important to know that you know charges are only applied to the total conversation time and not taken into consideration of each participant, which will naturally double the cost. So Transcribe automatically offers usage based discounts as well. So you know uh, as the usage increases, you get more discounts. So based on the tiered pricing mechanism, it has several out of the box features such as call analytics with call summarization, call categorization, issue detection, sentiment analysis. But it can also do speaker DRization, PI redaction, automated language identification, and multilingual audio transcriptions. Transcribe supports transcriptions of real time audio or video streams or even your pre recorded media content. For real time transcriptions, you can stream audio content to Transcribe using the HTTP2 or WebSocket protocol, 
and receive a continuous stream of transcription results. For batch processing, you can send your audio files stored in Amazon S3 to a transcribe and receive transcript of files as an output. And uh, you know, without further ado, actually, I would like to have Ithian talk about more of the cool things that they're doing with transcribe and talk about their call center uh, post-call analytics solution that they've built on transcribe. Ithian, over to you. Thank you, Prabhu. <clears throat> so uh, what an excellent segue. Uh, and to put things into context and let uh, everyone see, uh, understand the size and the need for, for the, the solution that we've built, uh, let me introduce Intac. So uh, Intact Financial Corporation is, the, is Canada's largest provider of uh, uh, property and casualty insurance. Uh, and is a leader in UK and Ireland since 2022, uh, 2021 with the purchase of RSA. So uh, we are, we have invested over $2 billion in technology. We have over 3000 experts in, uh, in technology, digital and data. And the tech team has doubled in three years. Our ambition is to be the best insurance shop in the world. And because we're one of the largest insurers in Canada, we have access to a breadth of data that, and this ensures that we are able to protect our dominant, dominant position using AI. So this is part of the vision of our CEO, Charles Bredamo, and we have put Intact has put in place the data lab or Intact data lab in order to be able to deliver the AI solutions for all Intact's business lines. The Intact Data Lab can, is, can, uh, can, is made of is built on uh, 500 around 500 data scientists, engineers, and data specialists. It has a foothold throughout Canada and Hong Kong. So we have uh, in the past years we have established a, 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 a branch in Hong Kong for specializing in AI. We have 400 plus models trained deployed and operated yearly. So these are models that are put in production and generating value, but there are over tens of thousands of experiments and new ideas and models being trained and validated throughout the year. So the task at hand that we've had was to modernize our contact center using AI. So we wanted to reduce the cost of serving customers without sacrificing uh, customer experience. In, an, in a context where Intact is growing, we have an increasing volume of audited call. Uh, in the current workforce market, retaining skilled agents is complicated and we wanna make sure that we are able to improve the agent's efficiency using AI. And of course, uh, one of the key benefits is that, and the key objective is to be able to rise, uh, to meet the right, ever rising customer expectations by providing actionable insights through high quality metrics. So in order to get there, we have built the call quality solution for post call analytics. There were several uh, uh, objectives and that we wanted to, that we, we strive for. So we wanted to be able to have a flexible platform and solution that supports multiple use cases. So we are able to use this solution for different subsidiaries and different lines of businesses. We wanted to be able as well to pre prepare and build a solution that is predictable and cost efficient. And as well, we have different various of volumes and processing needs. So we wanna be able to have a scalable environment that is able to meet our ever demanding needs. And of course, all of this needs to feed and provide the powerful, a powerful UI and dashboards that do offer search capabilities, metrics and insights to business dashboard to make better business decisions. We have decided to go and build the, the post call analysis solution, analytics solution of call quality around Amazon Transcribe. It has demonstrated a lower word error rate in English, and offered a great performance in French Canadian, or roughly around 4% more efficient than, uh, than some other solutions we've evaluated. 
And it's six per, we have seen since 2019 an, uh, an 6% improvement on where they were error rates. Of course, because we're serving uh, multiple language, uh, and since Intact is based in Canada, we have to be able to support French and English as well. So thus increasing the complexity of the solution in, our, in, specific, in making our requirements very high. Uh, and as well, we have the need for a highly scalable platform. So roughly speaking, we can process up to 800 calls simultaneously on Amazon Transcribe. And each and every night, we have some use cases and deployments that process 10,000 calls every night. So to be able to get there, we wanted to be able to leverage serverless and managed services around Amazon Transcribe. So the solution flow at a very high level is composed of four elements. So we have the, the call extraction, getting the data, the phone calls, the, the audio files and the metadata out of the telephony system. We have a process to do the call transcription uh, that uses Amazon Transcribe. And then the transcriptions that we are generated along with the metadata are sent to uh, AI models to extract insights and quality metrics or components and quality metrics out of calls. And then finally, the data that is produced is served to call quality agents. So call quality agents are the auditors that are processing calls and the, uh, auditing the calls for coaching opportunities and improvement, and as well to the business to identify improvement, uh, improvement path on call handling. So we have at Intact, uh, a contact center that is Genesis. We have different subsidiaries that are using different variations of the tool. And we have on, and therefore we have on-premises contact center and cloud contact center. So we have built a call acquisition process that is adapted to each of these use cases. And the all, all the story starts when we're getting these calls recording out of our audio recording solution, which is Verint, and we're sending it into S3, thus generating a call event. And we're, this, the story starts by sending the call, the event into event bridge to that processing pipeline here. So we have built a processing pipeline using flexible and serverless first services in AWS. The processing pipeline is adaptable to any PCA use case that we have at Intact. So we have divide, we are we are using it for different lines of businesses, but we as well use it to generate data for, uh, for more data science and experimentation purposes. So the, 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 it is highly configurable, built around Amazon Transcribes, and over the course of four hours, we are able to process roughly, in one use case, we are able to process roughly 10,000 calls every night. And then of course, all this, is involves the use and the the, uh, the leveraging AI models that data scientists are putting and working on. So this is the typical call processing workflow where we handle calls from Amazon so that we handle the event from Amazon Event Bridge. We send the transcription to transcribe and once the transcription is done in an asynchronous manner, we trigger the next step, which, which is to identify components. So there are two main things that we're looking for in calls, which are the call components and the quality metrics. And I'll give a brief overview of that later on. And then once this is processed, we have identified the components, we amend the, the metadata, and we submit the, the, uh, the transcriptions to different AI models. And we have roughly four or six of these AI models that are NLP based. And then finally, because we're operating in such a scale that we, uh, we, we need to, we figured cost saving opportunities, we're using MP3, uh, we're encoding the audio into MP3 to reduce the size of the files on Amazon S3 because we're maintaining them for 
the user to consult in the calculate uh, solution. And therefore, we're as well improving on the usability of the application. I mentioned that we are using and exploiting different AI models, ML models. So right now we have roughly five NLP models deployed across use cases. So we have such use, uh, we have such models such as uh, identifying the reason of call, doing sentiment analysis. Uh, we have speaker roles uh, separate. Uh, we have uh, speaker role identification models, and we have since we're, we're processing calls in French and English. Each of the models need to exist and be deployed for all of the languages. So therefore. We have built an, an inference serving platform around NVIDIA Triton inference server that feeds off queries from an AWS Lambda. So we have scaffolded uh, a, a cell, uh, entirely managed inference for um, inference serving platform that is auto scalable and is able to meet the uh, the expect the, the, the performance requirements that we have set in place. Of course, being able to serve models at scale involves strong NLOPS capabilities. So we have as well leveraged AWS serverless services to build an NLOPS platform that allows self-serving capabilities to data scientists to train and test model uh, to sorry, sorry to test models into an operational-ish context. And we're targeting to be able to do shadow deployment support. So thus, we are leveraging our platform and our services and our architecture to be able to improve the speed of delivery of models. So by working on this and improving a couple of things, we have been able to reduce the delivery time of new models from days to merely just hours through all these efforts that we've put in place in our, on our MLOPS platform. And of course, without being able to leverage all this hard work, it wouldn't actually be quite useful. So we've put enormous, enormous efforts in by building a powerful UI that allows efficient search through of, call comp uh, of calls through call components, thus simplifying the life of call quality agents in, in their work to find the, uh, the proper calls to audit and validate. <clears throat> so as you can see here on the left-hand side, we have the capability to search calls through different components. And here we are seeing an example of uh, an AI model providing a component, uh, uh, providing the capability to search through the reason of call. So we have AI model, we are leveraging our AI model and our search capabilities. Here we are different, we are having a different view. So I mentioned earlier on that we have call components and we have call quality, uh, we have call quality metrics. So call, uh, quality metrics. So we have built the UX around the timeline of the story of a call. So on the left-hand side, you can see the whole timeline with the components of a call, such as a reason of a call, the, uh, the, binding, level, uh, the binding part of a, uh, of a call, providing the code and so on. So we are able using our AI and our models and the processing in the data generated by the processing pipeline to see visually the story of a call. And as well, we are able to give the, the call quality agents capability to look through calls for specific quality metrics. And in this example here, we are identifying multi-vehicles uh, cost-saving opportunities. And if this system is extremely interactive. So we have call quality agents that are able to send feedback to the unit's manager or the agent himself to improve and send positive feedback. So we have as well built this capability inside the call quality solution. And then this is the part for the, 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 the call quality agents. But then again, this can also drive business decisions. So we have data scientists 
that have worked on trend dashboards for actionable business insights. These help identifying areas where agents spend their time. It allows business deciders to drill down to components to enable the identification of silence time, which is which are basically quick and easy opportunities to improve the agent end of time and as well provide a coaching opportunities and identify, identifying coaching opportunities. So this has produced results and has, uh, and has led us into towards a vision and what we're going to do next with this application. So in terms of tangible results, within one year, uh, in terms of speed, so that was one of the things we wanted to improve, we've seen a 15 times increase in auditing speed. We have seen a five times, a, time, a five-fold uh, increase in reviewed calls. And we, as well, as I mentioned earlier on, reduce the delivery time of new models from days to hours. In terms of efficiency, because we are able to identify coaching opportunities, we have seen a 10% reduction in agent send of time. And as well, auditors are 65% more, 65 more efficient using the call quality solution. So there are comparables with teams that are and aren't on the call quality solution. And we have extracted these, these improvements and efficiencies. And of course, this leads to calls, cost savings. So we are able to use the time of the auditors uh, more efficiently to devise coaching strategies improving scripts and help with agent training. And our vision, well, we are doing a post-call analytics solution, but as well, we, there is a path with the, the processing pipeline, the AI models that we built, the MLOps capabilities to go towards a real-time call analytics solution. And of course, the data lab is actively researching innovative ways to include generative AI in this call quality solution. Thank you for listening to me and on to you, Prabel. Yeah, thanks. Thanks, Etienne, uh, for sharing your tax story. And uh, it's actually really incredible to see the results that you, know, you guys have achieved by Thank you. leveraging Transcribe in your contact center solution. So I just wanted to bring the slide up again, and I just want to close off by saying that it, at AWS, we offer the broadest and deepest set of ML services, and AWS can really guide you on your ML journey. We offer in-person trainings, workshops for both technical and business stakeholders. And I just also wanted to emphasize that we learned how Intact is leveraging the different building blocks of AWS services to build their post-call analytics solutions. But we also understand that not everyone is an ML or DevOps specialist, right, or a DevOps expert. So, you know, we offer post-call analytics cloud formation templates, right, or infrastructure support templates that can be deployed and customized in your own environment to your own needs. You can also consume the PCS services using API. And if you prefer working with a partner or a service integrator, we have more than 20 AWS CCI partners who can work with you and understand backwards and work backwards from your context and your challenges and really help you find the right AI capability that you want in your existing contact center.